Are you a research scientist looking to get better results from your fragment-based drug discovery? It's become well known that fragment-based drug discovery is an efficient way of identifying small molecule leads and therefore fragment libraries are of great interest in both industry and academia. But here's the problem. Nature is three-dimensional and the majority of commercially available fragment libraries are populated with flat heteroaromatic chemotypes. The reason for this is that these structures were more detectable in NMR screening due to their well-resolved chemical shifts. In addition, a large number of fragment hits have been reported against the kinase ATP binding pocket, making traditional fragment-based discovery libraries more likely to be made to mimic the adenosine base of ATP and therefore be flat and sp2 rich. This old technology means fewer combinations and dimensions from your scaffolds and less selectivity against your targets, ultimately making your discovery work less effective. See, wouldn't it be great if you had better reagents to work with? Enter ChemDiv's Beyond the Flatland 3D Fragment Library. We have created one of the most cutting edge and advanced fragment-based drug discovery libraries on the market. Here's how it works. Nature is three-dimensional and therefore recognizes small molecules in a complementary 3D fashion. This means drugs are likely to be more selective for their targets if they are also three-dimensional. It's by no coincidence that compounds with diverse and well-developed 3D shapes have become the most attractive structures on the market for drug discovery over the last few years. Furthermore, the fraction of sp3 bonds known as the fsp3 parameter has become one of the most important criteria of a screening library's value. When we created this fragments library, we selected diverse and well-developed 3D shapes. Having a fragments library like this will expand the horizons of your fragment-based drug discovery program, enabling new opportunities in even the most challenging target classes like protein-protein interactions. The specifications of the library are as follows. In total, the library consists of more than 4,400 fragments, more than 1,100 fragments meet the strict Aztecs rule of three criteria, which is having a molecular weight of less or equal to 300, having a C log P value of less or equal to 3, having three or less hydrogen bond donors, and having three or less hydrogen bond acceptors. More than 2,850 fragments in this library contain at least one chiral center, and the library contains more than 450 spiro fragments. more than 200 bridged fragments. Here you can see how the fraction of sp3 bonds in the new fragments library contrast to our predominantly flat conventional fragment library. More than 80% of the new library members have an fsp3 of greater or equal to 0.4. And here you can see that the 3D library is more attractive in terms of diversity with a diversity coefficient of 0.9 compared to 0.87 for the conventional library. On this chart you can see how the higher degree of sp3 saturation favorably affects polar surface area. 16% of the conventional library lives in the pharmacologically unfavorable range of a PSA of greater or equal to 80, whereas the 3D library contains only 9.5% of such fragments. And on this chart, you can see the improvement in the C log P parameter compared to the conventional library. And finally here, you can see the improvement in the C log D parameter. Another important feature of the 3D Fragment Library is that more than 90% of the library members have arisen from our diversity-oriented synthesis program. This means that SAR is easier to do after you get hits and we can easily design and synthesize you additional sub-libraries should you need them. 
To be one of the first to receive this newly released library, send an email to marketing at chemdiv.com. That's M-A-R-K-E-T-I-N-G at C-H-E-M-D-I-V.com. As soon as we receive your email, we'll send you the structured data for this library along with pricing information. So what are you waiting for? The benefits of the new 3D Fragment library are clear. More opportunity for further fragment modification, the log P, PSA and water solubility parameters are all improved, there is more diversity and complexity, the fragments are more natural like, the fragments are more likely to have a better affinity and selectivity for target proteins and there is access to greater chemical space. So go ahead and send us an email to marketing at chemdiv.com. We look forward to hearing from you soon. Thanks for watching and thanks for choosing Chemdiv. We provide you the chemistry of cures.